Howdy, y'all. Let's just head over here into the Little Wonders. Oh, I can hear the last Big Daddy, I think. I should have hacked that. That was that was wasteful and lazy. Little one, we bring to certain smell the pheromone. But this is not like putting on aftershave. You will need three industrial applications of this stuff. And then the little ones will be thrown to you like a bee to honey. You will have to gather three pheromones here. So that you smell disgusting. Just like a big daddy. Did you just instantly kill the turret I hacked? God damn it. You asshole. Now you got a bolt sticking out of your body. Think about those life decisions that brought you here. I mean, you can't. You're gone now. Cigarettes in my lab? I can only be glad I am nowhere near you and that awful stink. Why the little ones are drawn to the smell of those pheromones is beyond anything I can understand. Really? I thought you were supposed to be smart. You don't understand pheromones? Okay. Also, a way to just fucking rub it in on me. Push me too far, kid. When you're cold and stiff, I'm gonna go over to Mother Goose's house, and I'm gonna take it apart, piece by piece, and brat by brat. Consider it your legacy. I know why it has to be children, but why just girls? I cannot determine why, but I know it is so. Fontaine says, Ah, oh, one less bathroom to build since you orphanage. It is amazing to watch the effect of Adam on their small bodies. Their own cells replaced by the new stems the instant they are damaged. These children are practically invulnerable. It is a shame you could not do the same thing to an adult. There would be quite a market for a man you could not kill. Little acknowledgement that the little sisters straight up cannot be murdered. But while they lampshade the idea that only little that little sisters have to be girls, they're still not explaining why there's on, why there aren't any boys in the entirety of Rapture, which is weird. Not even corpses of them. Like they even make a point to show you tons of dead little girls in this game. But they don't show a single dead little boy. It's just a really weird disparity. This isn't about like equal representation or anything like that. It's literally just like I'm questioning how this society can exist. How are the, how is there mysteriously no little boys in the entirety of it? Hello, welcome. God, instant hacking is so satisfying after playing that irritating minigame like a hundred times per playthrough. I would basically remove Pipe Dream from this game. I would rather have a dice roll that just says, Oh, nope, you failed, than uh, play to Pipe Dream for every hack. It's just not fun. I don't think anyone's like, Yay, Pipe Dream. I'm happy that's in the game. Oh, that wasn't your health bar. Shit. Eh, he'll figure it out. Oopsie. I think I was seeing my robots, yeah. I was seeing my bot's health bar, thinking it was the enemy's health bar, because that's who I was aiming at. And so I thought, I'm like, oh, he'll die in one pistol shot. Don't waste a bolt on him. Then he didn't die. It's very, very embarrassing for me. I haven't used a lot of this lately. Probably fix that. Keep hearing the Big Daddy, but not finding it. Soon, though. We'll find a way. All girls gather. They're just sleeping. They're angels. This makes it all better. What? I thought that was how that worked. Do I have to shock it? Oh well. Yeah. Oh, you got a little sister. How convenient. Hi there. Oh, that was a miss. Okay, that was a miss. That was a miss. That was a miss. <laughs> I'm good at video games. Wow, that was not, not my best. That was not my best. All right, we need to plan your murder now. I'm gonna really revolutionize things by, I'm gonna really catch you guys off guard with my my versatile and innovative strategy of Patoom. 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 
The longer he tries to gesture at me, the longer it'll take for him to realize he should probably be trying to kill me. You idiot. God damn it. Come and get me, buddy. I can't wait. Wait, how did you walk, like, past all of them? Wait, what? He, like, wasn't getting hurt by them. How's he feeling? How's he feeling? Ah! Uh, a little more alive than I was hoping. He's almost there. Yeah, that's a fun kill. Oh, he dropped a bomb on his body. That's a trap. That's a trap right there. Get up! Oh, yep. It is a thank you. Well, this is How can I thank you for this kindness? I send another little one with a token of our appreciation. How? I know I saw one that he walked past. How did he not hit this one? He walked straight through it. What the fuck? God damn. I just don't want to walk into it later, because I might go through there. Hmm. Yeah, that's, that's real... that's real weird. I don't know how he managed to walk past that one. Oh, uh, well. That's, uh... Yeah, that's all of them. I don't know why I checked. I got the achievement that said, deal with every little sister. That means we're good to go. It's good start. Now you need only to find the bodysuit and the voice box from the other labs, and you will be a proper fruit. Get moving. Oh man, it's such a sad episode where Scooby-Doo shits himself and dies. You should be thanking me! I brought you here! I showed you who you are! Nobody never told you nothing but lies till I come along! <laughs> what? You're like the first person I encountered, and you only lied to me. This guy just doesn't say things that make sense. That just what happened just now. What was that? Oh well. Uh, where are we in the progression uh, right now? Sound like a big daddy. Look, find a big daddy helmet. I need to sound like a big daddy, and I need to get their helmet. Okay. I also need to go find a place to spend money again, apparently, because I'm all stocked. I'm all overstocked again. Welcome to the Circus of Valor. I'm not even going to hack you, because, uh, eh? Could buy a hack tool, I suppose. I am wasteful. Yay. <laughs> there we go. That'll spend some of my money. That was worth it. Now I'm able to collect that one dollar. Uh, where'd this come from? Wasn't... Does pressing the right thing make it spawn or something? Is that like a Skinner's box right there? Ah! Uh, you can't get me. Wow, there's a lot of bombs around here. Oh no, another ki- oh. Oh right, because the mental conditioning, they, f don't they, f they force you to kill a uh, dog. Uh, they must do that to the little sisters too? In addition to me? so empowering to be able to skip the hack entirely. I feel so strong. Save cracker 2. Click. Shark. Bad shark. Uh. Thanks for that. 
I don't want to go on the table, Dr. Su Chong. Please don't cut me up and descend and change me who I am on a fundamental level. That'd make me sad, Dr. Su Chong. That $21 right there, that's a third of another auto hack that I can use for some reason. Oh, right. I'm definitely ready to finish the game, but I can't stop myself from exploring every room anyway. Because I've been I've been prepared to beat the game for a while now. There's not a lot left to do. Did you just fly directly into that bomb? I like how they both suicided. Thanks for the help. So cell two I can't get into from down here. Oh, somebody's in there. They've been making noises. Cell number two. Ah, 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 ah! Stop that. Rude. Which one is it? That is two, right? Yeah. That's the one I couldn't get into. Uh... There's a first aid kit under the bed, I guess. A hidey hole picture. God, those are creepy. It's our- it's the- it's the cells where we keep all of the children. So that we can mentally and- and biologically condition them. Hooray! So I should be- I'm done fighting big daddies now, unless there's another story point where you have to fight one or you- I aggro on an accident. <laughs> should be good to go now. just about done here too. I've kind of saved myself a bit of trouble by finding the helmet basically last. Because it means that I don't have to deal with the big daddy o vision for pretty big uh, a lot of the time where I might have had to deal with it otherwise. My daddy's smarter than Einstein. Stronger than Hercules. He can start a fire with a snap of his finger. This game's really heavy on repeating dialogue that like drills its way into your brain. <laughs> until it's all you can think about. Oh, that was just wasteful. Stilled water. I think that might have been one of the last ones I found. Yeah, I'm kind of getting flashbacks. When I was doing my when I was doing my run where I tried to collect every single one in the entire game, that was probably one of the last ones I found because it's a secret one. Because a lot of them are just like a giant recording device sitting in the open, but some of them, like that one, are are inside of a uh, box. And some of them are missable boxes. Here's where you'll be finding the voice box to have sound like one of those big daddies. Retopsive creatures. That wasn't very nice. That's called camping, and I don't appreciate that. Cut that out. I don't know what to prioritize. I always want to use Berserk so I can use that to take care of people, but uh, I often need to have my electric selected for all these surprise security systems trying to get me. I tried to help you, but sometimes I I, I make mistakes. Hey there, join me. Kill all the other people for me, please. There's the exit. Oh, 
Oh, he just left. All right. So much for my eventful kill. Yay! I did it. Fun. Hi. Ow. No, I don't want to talk to you. Creepy. Don't run. That was harmful to me. Uh oh. There you go. Not my finest moments. Just trying to use other tools here and there instead of the same one over and over again. Let's see, where did I come from? It was right here. Hi. Uh, it was through here. All right, so let's check from here. Anything I'm missing? Got some batteries. Corpsey McCorpsington. Bunch of weird glowy things everywhere. A real strange space. I mean, really, I might as well. Where'd he go? Join me. I'm your little sister now. Your real little sister's not even real anymore, so... Get busy. Kill that guy. Ow. That hurt. Dead now? Oh, he's so dead. Alright. I can go into back, back into tag your it mode with this uh, pistol now. I'll admit Fontaine showed some foresight when he built up the plasmid business, but the man really never understood sales. Hiding those little girls beneath a bushel. I've just seen the preliminary design work on the new plasmid machines, and they're ex- God damn it. You think two-bit heroics count for a fig in this pit? You're staring down the puke stain of Ryan's busted dream! Even down here? Then you deserve to gargle with the rest of these scrubs. You interrupted my podcast. Get him. I'll admit Fontaine showed some foresight when he built up the plasmid business. But the man really never understood sales. Hiding those little girls beneath a bushel. I've just seen the preliminary design work on the new plasmid machines, and they're exactly what I wanted. Mark my words. Presented properly, those little sisters are marketing gold. Ryan sent over extra munitions. He must have suspected trouble. I've locked them up near the protector labs and set the code to 1921. I don't expect we'll ever be needing them, though. Once Big Daddy is ready, nobody cross the Big Daddy. How'd that work out for you? You coming after me? It's funny to hear old recordings of Andrew Ryan being talking down to Fontaine. Like, Poor stupid Fontaine just didn't understand this or that when like Fontaine seems to have dominated him on every possible level over the course of this game. Like things have cut this game could not possibly be more team Fontaine as far as the outcome of who won until this point narratively. Hey, power to the people. Kickback, I guess? Sure. Look at that animation. Look at that. Look at that guy. All right. Come on. You want me to teach you to dance? I'm real wow. I couldn't pick up even one thing from inside that. <laughs> that's where we. That's where we are these days, huh? Well, if anything attacks me, they're pretty screwed. I've got a, a big daddy, and every other room has a turret or a camera on my team. Come at me. <laughs> I dare you. <laughs> oh wait, these turrets might aggro the big daddy. Should I be worried about that? I should probably be worried about that, but I think... Oh, he just changed. Oh, he's not on my team anymore. I guess that deals with that. Ow!
I didn't plan that very well. Holy shit. I was just focused on getting to that thing before it uh, ran out. I was not sufficiently focused on the fact that the whole thing was in bad, bad time shape. <laughs> Come and get me. Trying to make good use of my toys. Yep. You coming? You coming? You want to come play? You want to come play? You want to come play? <laughs> what the fuck are my turrets doing? Oh my god, they're not very receptive, are they? Wow, they take so long to shoot that they basically blow themselves up. Damn. Not big on line of sight. Oh well. It was cool that one time I came out to my turret though and saw like a hundred corpses in front of it. What the hell? That's spooky. Is there a way to turn you off? I don't remember. Might have been one of the more pointless hacks that I've done so far. I'll double charge it. That doesn't work that way. Alright. That was a bit of a wasteful reload. I don't recognize this room. Oh. At least turrets had a bad time. Hey, buddy. Alarm expert two. Make the alarms even less alarmy than ever before. Like all of these, though, these are all good things to have. Oh, oh it's four fewer alarms when hacking. Right, that is a hacking one. Uh, let's let's go. Gross. Look at you. We will make big daddy out of you yet, I think. But there's only one piece missing. The bodysuit. Go to fail-safe armored escort. That's such a bizarre and horrifying machine that the fact that our character so willingly and quickly is able to sign up for this is like... It makes me think that Tenenbaum's just controlling us in some way that isn't confirmed. Similarly to how the other people have been controlling us. Or we're just really that spiteful. Because that's some next-level grody-ass self-modding. Getting a lot of focus on these guys right now, huh? There you go. They're very rude. They're, that's called piling on, sir. You shouldn't do that. But yeah, like, the, 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 our willingness to do this shit is, like, super concerning at some point. Oh, and the whole excuse is just that we have to get past a door. We can only get past if a little sister gets, uh, opens it. Like, after all the shit we've been through, whenever there's something gets in our way, we find a way around it and stuff like that. The idea that, like, this is the only way forward is to permanently modify ourselves in some insane level, as opposed to just try to finding... Like, just trying to find another way in. Like, the fact that our character just is like, Well, I guess it's, I guess it's the only way is, like, super alarming. Uh... All I've got left to get is the helmet, huh? I don't... ...think I even see on the map. Uh-oh. That chunk of map over there is actually called Optimized Eugenics. Yeah. Yeah, where is, uh... Where would I go to get a helmet? I don't have a waypoint. It looks like I've been everywhere. The reasonable assumption there is probably that I've just... I don't know, maybe I, maybe I get on the way out. You probably do the vocal change before you put your helmet on, right? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. 
All I know is I don't see a waypoint, I don't see anything on the map. Then the whole map looks like it's been fully explored, which is a bit concerning when you still have an objective to do. Oh, search failsafe armored. Where's that? Failsafe armored straight ahead. Hey, buddy. I haven't hacked this one yet? No. Oh, well. Just spending money. Ooh. Even more. Oh, that was a waste to buy that stuff then, wasn't it? My final thank you. 350 Adam. What do I want? Not sure. Making freeze stronger doesn't hurt. A lot of these are kind of whatever. I'm beyond. In fact, I'm beyond the usefulness of a lot of them at this point. Sure, Winter Blast Three. Instead of Hypnotize Big Daddy. Probably done fighting those guys. Insect Swarm Three. Why not? I could level up something I already have. Extra nutrition, which is not even what I have equipped right now. Eve Saver. Probably gonna be done with security soon. So might as well grab that, I guess. Machine Buster. For when they send nasty machines after me. Now I greatly increase my damage versus them things. Which is worth getting rid of Photographer's Eye. The final boss might summon... Uh... Bots to attack me, I don't remember. But Photographer's Eye is kind of pointless because the game's over. I don't... I think the only thing I haven't fully researched in the entire game... It might be... Oh yeah, turrets probably. Turrets and bots might not be fully researched, but mainly... It's the, uh... The Little Sisters have not been fully researched at this point. But at this point, probably not gonna happen. Let's go find ourselves a helmet. Candidate conversion. Things seem to have gotten a little explodey around here. Have I seen where the helmets are? Or... I mean, I spent a little... Uh, hi. There we go. Nice little hush, hush. Ooh, more hacking. I've probably looked straight at the helmet, but it wasn't collectible yet, because I had to go do the other mods, probably. Got her. Don't even need that Z button. Overflowing with them dollars. You'd think I could just get the helmet off of all the big daddies I've been fighting all the time. But surprisingly, only one piece came from past kills. Muchos gracias. Yeah, and made all of you dead. <laughs> How'd that work out for you? Those are distinctly not helmets. Very clearly. Here's the big bad central room with my not very useful turret that doesn't tend to get kills. Maybe he's in this room. No. No helmets around here. No such luck. 
The map's not any help. Could, uh, I looped around upstairs already, too. Isn't that what it said to go? Look, find a big daddy helmet. Looking fail-safe armored escorts. Where I am. That was not my best shot. An attempt was made. Ooh, are you gonna come after me? Please do. Please do. Please do. Yay! We got her. <laughs> that was exciting. Were you excited? I was excited. I already checked here, right? There's like, there's like gloves here. That's the airlock back out. Oh. How did I keep missing this room? Okay. Oh, that's water. I thought it was oil. I'm like, damn. A lot. So many helmets to choose from. They don't let you be a bouncer, do they? You have to be a Rosie? Yeah. What if I want to be a bouncer? Why do I have to be a Rosie? Also, why are there, like, no bouncers in the entire game? Why is every single one a Rosie? I'm trying to go back. Like, ever since I, ever since I said all, the bounce, all of the Big Daddies are Rosies instead of bouncers, I've killed, like, nine Big Daddies since then, I want to say. And they've- and all of those were also Rosies. It's weird that the bouncer's on the cover. He does look cooler. Maybe on easier difficulties, there's more bouncers? Because I think they're probably easier to fight because they're melee, so they chase you. So I think they, they might have switched them all to Rosie on hard mode, but I genuinely don't remember. It just, it just does stand out how few, uh, bouncers there were. Oh yeah, goodbye now FOV. This is a big daddy. Are you ready? Now go to the little sister then, by the oh my girl. God. Oh my Are you okay? Oh I'm such a big day that my hands are still naked. It's a little weird. I don't need to fight you guys. I'll just enrage you all and keep going. That's the upgrade spot. Are they chasing me still? They probably are. They were just about there. Narratively, not a lot happens after the twist. For this whole chunk, we're all like, it's just a lot of Fontaine uh, taunting us and us going off to kill Fontaine and Fontaine being like, oh, I'm not scared. It's kind of like the last three hours of the narrative. <laughs> 